This video will show you how to make a playlist in Jazzler to schedule to play on the radio. So you open up Jazzler Workstation and you get this window. You want to go to the scheduling tab and then come down here and click once on playlist programming. That brings up this window. We're going to make a brand new list. There's some lists here, but we're going to make a new one. So add and then name it practice three. That's what I'm going to name this. All right, up here. And then the minute that you in, enter, um, it, it has your playlist name right here and it brings you to this window which is the edit playlist window and here are your songs now there are other tabs up here like you might have spots uh, to to put in between the songs you might record something you might have something on a file it might be a show for the purposes of this video I'm just going to pick four songs um, and make, and this will be a playlist. Okay, here are the four songs. Now you can preview these by pushing up here, but make sure that you have the top song selected. Otherwise, it'll just play from whatever song you have selected and down. So just select the top song. You can also push the play button down here. Okay, the play button is playing whatever selected in this box. But if you double click this, it will play There it goes. So those, that's two ways that you can get, get to that. Okay. Um, when you're picking your songs, you want to make sure that your filters aren't shut down and you, you know, you want to make sure you have the biggest uh, selection of songs you can. So make sure these are on all. And, and not narrowed down. Okay, so here's your playlist. Um, let's decide when to play it. And the way you do that is to come up to this tab, Play Dates and Times. And we're going to add. And so you can pick a date here and a time. Now, this is the default. It just opens up at the time that is right now. So I'm just going to push OK. Um, comments probably would say play, maybe describe the playlist and mention like, oh, I'm going to play this once a week for six weeks, that kind of stuff in there. So I'm just going to put playlist practice in there and then author manager put your name in there okay now this window's done but there's nothing down here there's no way to get out except to come up and just push the X all right here are the playlists available and here is my new playlist practice three but you'll notice nothing has populated there's no time. Nothing has happened yet. There, the songs should be listed over here. So with that highlighted, you have to come down and push OK. And the minute you do that, it takes you back to this box. But you just push this again to get right back. And then you go select it again. And this time, the time is in there. 
it's all populated and here are your songs. Now to get back to that edits, oh, first you wanna look and see your playlist scheduled. Now I've been practicing this all evening, so <laughs> they're kind of stacked up here, but here it is. And if I double click that, it takes me back to this, this one. Okay, now if I wanna edit the playlist, I, I'm sitting here thinking, oh, I wanna add another song. I can go in there and I've added another song. And maybe I want to replace this song with a different one. So I pick this button here and replace it. Maybe I want to insert a spot or another song ahead of that one. So there. Now I've changed the playlist and so go back to play dates and times just to get to this window. Keep this all the way it is and then coming up to the X. Now the new songs aren't showing. So you have to go down here and push OK again for those new edits to take effect. And remember, push that again. Go back to your playlist. And it takes a minute. I'm going to push it again. It's still not doing it. So I'm going to go to edit. There they are. You just have to do that a few times uh, to get that to show up. I, I don't know why, but you just got to keep pushing OK until everything's there. So that's how you do it. Um, you can come back here and add it to play more. And um, that's how you make a playlist.